Randleberg, your concierge yacht broker, Fort Lauderdale, aboard the All Seas 92 Expedition Trawler at the helm. You go into the pilot house itself where everything happens. And as you can see, the controls, the electronics, everything's been updated. Stellar systems. It's using HP panels to pretty much run the whole boat. Got your power searchlight. Got your controls. This is your steering gear, commercial grade steering gear. Electronic engine controls. And back here are the guests to watch the show. Let's talk about the helm. The helm. The helm is controlled by a jog switch. We don't have a wheel. There's a jog switch here. There's a jog switch on the flybridge. There's also override controls in the lazarette, the event of emergency. You also have multiple stations for the remote, which gives you thruster controls. It gives you rudder control, and it gives you engine controls. It allows you to steer the boat. It's on a 50-foot cable. We'll go all the way to the back of the boat deck, all the way to the bow, or beam to beam. 72 mile for Runo radar, standalone. Um, the autopilot pilot is a comm nav. It's tied into our open CPN um, software. The um, stabilizer system, but anyway, it runs from here. Your thruster controls, your Furuno controls for the forward looking sonar. The Furuno net 2.0 version is fed into this computer and controlled from here. It takes up a small portion of the screen. The other part is going to be the weather facts overlay so that you can have both running at the same time. And the forward scanning sonar, does it scan down and forward? And side to side, yeah. pick an angle, yeah. and so on. Okay. And it's not, it's not a fish finder, it is actual sonar. Good. Okay. And it is very good for looking right under the surface, all ahead forward, and we'll pick up a deadhead. Perfect. We're also using FLIR forward looking infrared, which mm -hmm. will pick up, uh, for instance, a whale at 200 yards. Wow. Um, it'll pick up a little inflatable, just the heat of the guy's body and the heat of the outboard mm -hmm. when you can't see anything else. And it saved a couple guys already. Mm -hmm. um, we've got the GPS, etc. Double um, VHF radio. We use one on channel 72 for the crew when we're docking, the other on 16 or whatever. Air conditioning with blowers. Separate engine controls. These are the manuals. They're repeated within the monitoring system that you'll be able to pick up on either of the computers. However, each of these will tell you exactly what's going on. Rudder angle indicator. Uh, switching controls for your LED floodlights. Floodlight on the fore deck for when you're doing the anchorage there. Flood the boat deck so that you can manipulate your um, tenders on the boat. Plus, you also have your crab lights. We have the fishing boat-like crab lights that are up on the top fore and aft and you can control the hydraulic clutches to be able to kick in uh, on the generator so that you're not running it all the time and you need thrusters all of a sudden you can turn them on and off here and then the outside deck lights run from here your searchlight the horn slash whistle that does all the cute little toot toots and all that crap we don't use it the horn itself uh, will go through all the normal sequences and stuff for different events 24 volt control and your engine controls your warning alarm and the control for the um, Gyro stabilized satellite TV are all in this area. Right. So this is your DC panel. Down below is your alarm panel. Nav lights, flood light controls. Nav lights, flood light controls. Got it. Engine alarms for both the mains and your satellite control. Access under the console, there's enough room to sit up, maneuver underneath. Uh, you can also use switch over and use the handheld controllers for the radios. Full size map drawer, chart drawer. Yes. Love it. For nighttime running for Great. each of the computers. Wow. And those are off the shelf panels or they self standing computers? Those are HP just bought them at uh, Best Buy. Best Buy HP computers run this. Com it's uh, open source software mm -hmm. and readily available online. The charts come from NOAA, they're downloadable, mm -hmm. updated by the government at whatever re regular intervals. You download them on the internet, put them on, picks them up manipulates them accordingly. This is WeatherWorks, which picks up from XMFM. Uh, I just bought a weather fax setup with the radio receiver and all, which will go on the other machine and tie into the OpenCPN over there. 
Now, behind this panel is the bubble catcher, if you will, where the air conditioning feed loop, circulation loop, and we do uh, bubble catching, etc. there, bleed it off, and so on. So it's easy. It's none of this crawling into some dark mm -hmm. container. It's all there. Uh, also, the cabling runs up to the flybridge from there. Air conditioning. Cabinetry. All the equipment's maintenance logs. Oh, these are submersion suits. Survival suits. There are 10 on board. So I'm Randall Berg. Contact me if you want to get on board the All Season 92. Have a great day.